Hello mga KBs, Kerobians and friends. I'm here again, your No Ordinary Advisor, sharing some of my money confessions. This series talks about some raw, candid sharing of my personal experiences, past mistakes, poor financial decisions, and realizations that I hope you can learn from and be encouraged by. Money confession number five. In 2018, when a good friend of mine died from a hip and run car incident. That was a wake-up call for me. Not only was he a good friend, he's a colleague of mine whom I see every day of the work week. And so we shared memorable moments together. I was awakened to the shortness of life and how our departure here on earth can affect and impact the lives of those who are left behind. I've witnessed the trouble and inconveniences in doing all the arrangements and logistics, especially in the repatriation, how limited company coverage is. I've also witnessed the pain and suffering of his family, especially in the time of pandemic, when the income stopped flowing in. I think it could have been worse if he stayed in the hospital before passing away, because I can imagine the bills to be humongous by the day. Why was it a wake-up call for me? Because by the end of 2018, I resigned from my job of almost 11 years so I can become a financial advisor. I thought if I can help one family, one individual, one company at a time to make better financial decisions, their trajectory in life would be moving towards a better outcome. Please, before it's too late, do what is necessary now. Don't wait for bad things to happen or for unforeseen circumstances to really knock you down to the ground. If I can be of further assistance to you, do let me know. That's also the reason why I have these episodes of Money Confession and uh, the OMG Journey with G. So you can be uh, enlightened in terms of your financial journey and how you can better prepare for the future. And by the way, in my next episode, I will also be tackling the different types of insurance so that I can explain it to you in simple ways without even selling you anything. Build that knowledge bank in yourself so that you can make wiser choices for yourself and for your loved ones. That's all for now. It's Friday. Have a great weekend ahead. Bye!